Hi, I'm here to tell you about the more advanced features of the file to part software and to tell you more about what happens in the background to models when we fix them for printing. In this view we allow the user to view every different shell in the model. We also provide the same functionality in real color. We allow the user to select each shell individually. If they want to, we can add translucency and display edges on each selected shell. When viewing shells individually, we can zoom right in to the shell, go back to the full view, and we can also examine any structural issues. In this particular case, this shell is hollow inside and every shell must be closed in order for it to be printed. Another thing we need to look out for when printing 3D models is the thickness of each element. In this case, this piece of hair has zero thickness and this shell cannot be reproduced physically in our printer. Now that we've identified the problems, we can fix them by selecting certain elements. And we can focus on the hair in this particular case. As you can see again, it has zero thickness and, and we can apply the add thickness operation to every single shell separately. You can see the thickness being added as I click on it and we can do the same add thickness operation to all displayed shells. We can then invert the displayed shells and when examining this, we can again see that these shells aren't closed and for that we can use the patch holes operation on the selected shell. So as you saw when I clicked on it the hole has been closed and now when we print it it will be a solid model. We can apply the same operation to other shells. And afterwards, we can examine the model in the slice view to confirm that it's ready for printing. So now all you have to do is click print.